of course, I think now, as hip hop's evolved, yes, the great, uh, yes, he can be white uh, now because every every hip hop is evolving, and, and, and all races are really, you know, are putting in time into hip hop and years gone by, and mm -hmm. people are paying their dues, as I've called it. As far as Dr. Umar, I see where he's coming from, um, you know, but then the argument is the same thing as like, okay, well. Dr. Naismith invented basketball, then how could Michael Jordan be the best at basketball? And, mm. you know, the thing is, the thing is, the argument is that hip hop has taken, has been so personal to black people's lives other than it just being a music. Mm -hmm. And maybe that's where I think the line gets blurred, the lines are blurred because this, how we may look at hip hop, there's a certain white culture that might not look at it like that as far as hip hop goes. So in those, it depends on what lens you have on. Mm. Um, with, with, with Joe Buttons, it, I, you know, I've never seen nobody like be a fan. Like it's one thing about being a fan of somebody, but then it's another thing being on somebody's dick. <laughs> it's just, it's like I can understand a fan, but then it's like when you on somebody's, that's just a, that's a personal thing, you know what I'm saying? And, mm -hmm. and, and to me, with him, and I, and I think all, you know, everybody can have their personal favorites, but it's like, man, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, he don't cheer, he don't cheer like that for nobody else, you know what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. the way he stick for Eminem, and it's not like he talks about him all the time, but when he does, he really like, you know what I'm saying? And to me, I, you know what I'm saying? It's, I don't know, man. I think I think Dr. Umar, like me, just gets tired of that shit. Like, mm. bro, like, relax. <laughs> like, okay, he's good. Like, okay, this is 100 years later. Like, you know what I'm saying? Um, So I can understand D Dr. Umar gets frustrated as, as I do. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's a frustrating thing. M can rap. I always say this. I don't like even doing top five dead alive because I believe hip hop is so great and people have their own style it's hard to be like oh he's the greatest he's the like if you're listening to somebody's album and you love it then you love that artist mm. you love it then you love that artist and you it's this it doesn't have to be better and who's better and who's the it doesn't have to be that way eminem raps a certain way like he puts out a certain type of music it's not like it's not like it really sounds that much like almost anything else that's popular it's, in it's really his own lane of yeah. music you see what i'm saying so because that's not my lane, don't get mad at me. I think Eminem fans take it so personal that, well, he's the greatest. Okay, that he's the greatest to you, and that's cool. To me, he's not. You know what I'm saying? That's okay. Like, mm. Joe, Joe, Joe got the, the platform, and Joe, you got Dr. Umar up there. Like, my thing was Joe knew how to set off Dr. Umar. Mm. He set him off. That's a good point. He, he know how to set Dr. Umar. Joe's, Joe's brilliant. He know how to do that. And believe me, Dr. Umar got, cause, because the dude next to Dr. he got him good. I was like, oh man. Well, keep in mind with Joe, he's the same guy who basically f***ed up his relationship with Eminem and Slaughterhouse by right. being brutally <laughs> honest about record. Eminem. And they did yeah. a whole diss record. Like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I used to be like, come on, man. Like, listen, I swear to you, my thing wasn't about the music. It just wasn't. Like, I had my own personal issues on what I thought of hip hop and that's probably where I made the mistakes by involving the source because the source is supposed to be for the masses mm -hmm. and I've let my personal and I've said that on math and that was that was a mistake that was wrong I wouldn't call it a mistake but being business wise it was wrong mm -hmm. okay you know what I'm saying you don't you're not supposed to do that that's not good business and um um but I, I don't listen to his music anyways mm -hmm. it's not just him there's not a black artist that I don't listen to their music anyways. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's it's, it's all right. I know it, our situation's polarized because of the beef, because of us going back and forth, but that's what hip hop was anyways. Like, big deal. We went, I made a few songs, he made a few songs, so what? I've never even met Eminem. Mm. I, would I would love one day, I mean, before I go and before he go for us to sit down, and just have a conversation about hip hop and have a conversation about I mean that would be so epic to me because it's bit with us it's bigger than hip hop. You have way more in common than you have that separates. You. I believe that. Yeah. I believe that and and again again a lot of times it be Eminem's fans that it, yeah. it don't even be him. It's his fans that make you just most of the shit that I've said on the internet is probably because of his fans not even him. Mm. Cuz he don't even he don't even speak on shit. Ever. He barely does. Yeah. 